How's it going out there, gamers? It's Real Easy here, and I'm back today. Thank God it's Friday. Hope everyone's having a great day out there, and I hope everyone has a great day as well. But today, right now, I want to talk about how I was able to store all the personal vehicles from all the story mode characters. I'm talking about Franklin's uh, bagger right here, the motorcycle, uh, Trevor's truck, Franklin's buffalo, and Michael's tailgater with the, uh, with the money signs uh, rims on it. Now, I was actually able to store all of them except for the uh, for the bike in the same session. So whether I got lucky and got, you know, a session that was ready to go or, you know, a lucky session, I don't know. But I do have a lot of really good tips out there to show you guys and to explain on how I was able to succeed. Uh, a shout out to uh, Tron over on Seven Sins because a lot of the tips that I read from Tron that he was helping out people with in the community did help me come out with this little pattern or conclusion you know that I came out with that did work for me to be able to actually store all these personal vehicles uh, the bagger I got lucky with but the rest of them I did use this pattern for so let's get started and uh, this footage right here actually shows me driving Michael's tailgater right into the uh, Los Santos customs just like that you see it was able to open and I was, I was to my surprise it opened I was not ready for that whatsoever now, um, first tip that I can give you guys is don't drive any personal vehicles from your online character. It's better if they're not on the map at all, honestly. And uh, I'm going to show you that pattern that I did, you know, real, you know, real soon. Just I wanted to show you guys the footage of me literally getting every single one of these uh, vehicles from uh, online. And like I said, the three cars, the truck, this car and uh, the Buffalo, I was able to get all in the same session. All right, and uh, yeah, so it's better if those personal vehicles from the from your online character aren't on the map at all. So before you go ahead and do this glitch, I would definitely recommend actually putting away in the garage or return to storage any of your personal vehicles, you know, uh, on your online character, then exit out to story mode and go ahead and try out the glitch. And uh, this thing is still working, guys. I've been hitting this all morning, uh, making some modded outfits. If it's still working later today, I'll actually come out with a modded outfit tutorial either today, tonight or tomorrow. Uh, we'll have the whole weekend, hopefully, and I can make some really cool stuff for you guys. But uh, yeah, so this is the footage of Trevor's truck, and now we're going to get into the pattern right here. And there's plenty more tips to come, okay? But uh, yeah, so I actually spawned in as Franklin, and I got out of Franklin's house, and I was like, all right, you know what? Let me just hop into the Buffalo. I'm going to try this method right here. So I hopped into Franklin's Buffalo and what I do now is I actually drive the three, the, the two, you know, things that I'm using are I have the apartment at Integrity Way and you're going to see right here I drive straight to Integrity Way, needed to fast forward so the video wouldn't be way too long. So I go to Integrity Way, this vehicle cannot be stored in your garage. You know, I wanted to get that message and then I go to my CEO office right here at Arcadius, same message, the vehicle cannot be stored in your garage. So what I proceed to do now is go to the downtown Los Santos Customs in the middle of the city vehicle cannot be modified I said you know what let me just try this pattern out let me just see if something works so I went back to integrity way nothing at integrity way I had heard Tron say just do this a bunch of times and you'll get it but I wanted to actually just do the same pattern over and over again vehicle cannot be stored in your garage back at Arcadius okay and then now I'm gonna go over to Los Santos customs back in downtown once again vehicle cannot be modified okay and by recording this footage I had already known that I was actually going to be able to hit it because I already got the uh, the other vehicles. So now I drive over down to the Los Santos Customs uh, in the southern part of the city and check this out. This is all non-cut, non -cut, just, you know, uncut. This is just literally me recording, you know, and I fast forwarded it so it wouldn't be so long. But look at that. It was able to just let me right into the Los Santos in the southern part of the city. That's it, guys. That's literally the method that I use. So once again, I went from Integrity Way to Arcadius to Los Santos. I did that twice, that method, um, Integrity Way, um, Arcadius, and then Los Santos downtown. Integrity Way, Arcadius, Los Santos downtown. I got all the messages and then that was it. I was able to go right down to the southern part San Andreas or southern Los Santos Customs and I was able to actually just open up the garage. Now, some little things that I do wanna add. Um, Right when you spawn down, make it the first thing you do once you spawn in as your story mode character. These are really good tips, guys. Um, and if you need to, get a store, uh, get a uh, street vehicle or go on foot. I was actually, when I got this bagger right here, I was actually, um, I spawned down by that Los Santos Customs in the southern part of the city. So I just grabbed a street car. 
and I actually got the streetcar and took it all the way to Franklin's house to go grab this. So no personal vehicles from online. I do believe that it kind of screws around with uh, with you being able to get these vehicles. Uh, now, another little thing to add, my story mode progression is at 78%. I don't know if that has anything to do with it, but I just wanted to let you guys know that I have beat the game already, and I've gotten pretty far in it. Uh, a little thing also, doing this glitch, I actually obtained a Halloween face paint on my online character. I never had a Halloween face paint, but now I have the, uh, the all black one. So uh, yeah, that's another little thing to add about this, but check this out. So with the bagger, I literally, you know, I spawned, I drove a streetcar to uh, Franklin's house, grabbed the motorcycle, and I wanted to try out the method. So I just went over to my integrity way, and look at this, it let me in first try. I was super surprised and I had to remove a, you know, a car from there and there's no way that I was going to back out and risk it not working again so I went ahead and hit OK so I got lucky storing Franklin's motorcycle. It let me in first try but like I said that's the first thing I did when I got in online. Took a street car to Franklin's house, got the motorcycle, drove it straight to this garage. So I don't know if you need these, these, this garage itself but this is what worked for me. People have used Tinsel Towers, other people have used Del Perro. Uh, I don't think it matters really. I think it's just a little bit of luck and like I said That was my pattern that I used or my formula to get the other three vehicles this one I just got a bit luckier on But uh, yeah, so make sure like I said you put all of your vehicles in your garage before you do the glitch So when you spawn down as your story mode character, you don't have any on the map um, Don't try to enter any Los Santos customs not even on foot Don't try to get any of those messages until you have the vehicle that you're trying to store, the story mode vehicle, you know, whether it's Trevor's truck or whatever. Uh, that's another thing, yeah, just don't get any sort of messages like that, that it can't be stored or modified before you start uh, doing that little pattern that I was saying. And uh, yeah, I really do think that that's it. Another little uh, tidbit to add is that my spawn location has actually always been that Southern uh, Los Santos Customs. Ever since I started doing this glitch, I always spawn down in that location. If you see in my previous videos, I'm always spawning down at that Los Santos Customs in the south part of the city. And I'm also always uh, eating the peyote that's right there. So if that, whether that glitched out that garage or not, I'm not sure. But uh, I actually tried to cut the steps and I tried to just do the uh, Integrity Way Arcadius Los Santos Customs downtown one time and then went over to the south part. Didn't work. So the Southern, you know, the Southern Los Angeles Customs didn't let me in. I had to do the full rotation, do those three places and then do them again and then go down to the Southern part of the uh, map to go to that Los Santos Customs. But I just want to let you guys know those are my methods. If you have any questions, it might not work for you guys. I just wanted to show you what I did and how I got it to work. And clearly I'm going to show you right now when I park this in here, I got all four vehicles that I wanted right here. There they all are, all right? So uh, yeah, if you like the video, go ahead and slap that like button, subscribe to me if you're new by hitting the big red button, and turn on them post notifications for the freshest and most informative dope GTA 5 online content. Peace out everybody.